Hi, welcome back to Shotoku Tech. I got so excited when I saw this Remote Plus from M5 Stack that I went right out and made a video about it. M5 Remote is a game changer. You'll want to check it out. But then I realized in this tweet, they also are talking about this Easy Data. Well, what is Easy Data? Easy Data is a cloud IoT data storage solution from M5 Stack, and it's free. You can insert or extract data into the storage queue through a unique token. So this is MQTT, and it's secured by your token. Here are the commands. You can save or get individual values, and you can also retrieve lists. Okay, so the unique token is generated by your browser, and you want to make sure you keep a copy of it. If no data operation is performed within a half a year, the data queue corresponding to the token will be cleared. The data is stored in ascending order, meaning the last item inserted is at the top of the list. So you can get a value, save a value, or you can also get lists. So let's check out my example code. Basically, I have two core units that we're going to use for this experiment. And we're going to have two topics. Core A is going to be published by the first core unit. And core B topic is going to be published by the second core unit. If you push button A, you'll publish and if you push button C, you'll retrieve. Here's the user interface. I've got four labels here, and then I hide them all because I'm only going to show them when there's an actual event. So we're already connected to the first core unit, and again, we're going to publish to topic core A and retrieve from topic core B on the first core unit. All right, here's my two core units. I'm going to go ahead and upload to the first one on the left here. Yeah, you see the labels went by and then they got hidden. So now for the second unit, it's going to publish to core B topic and retrieve from core A topic. So the two core units will be sending messages back and forth. Here, I've got to get the API key for the other core unit there. Now we're connected to the second one on the right. We'll go ahead and upload this code now that we've changed the topics. There we go. You see it's running. So let's test it out. So I'm sending hello zero. And I'm retrieving hello zero from the core A topic. We'll run this up a little bit. Hello, one. Hello, two. And hello, three. Published to the core A topic. And you see here we're retrieving the core A topic on the second unit. Hello, three. Now, on the second unit, I'm going to send a message to the core B topic, hello zero. On the first unit, the C key retrieves from the core B topic, hello zero. All right, so make sure to follow Shotoku Tech and M5 Stack on Twitter. And you're going to enjoy checking this easy data out for yourself. Like I say, it's free and it's secured with your very own token. Thanks again to M5 Stack for this interesting IoT offering. And if you haven't seen this video, M5 Remote is a Game Changer, check it out. Leave a comment down below. Give this video a like. And before you go on to watch the rest of my M5 Stack videos, please click on subscribe. Thank you very much.